Hi, I'm Mark Goodchild. I'm from Ginger Snap, and we're a, a tech development house and a app studio making story apps that you can personalise and gift to your kids. So our story apps are designed for adults to download uh, a story that we've uh, created, usually in association with a museum or an institution, uh, something to do with their own passions, maybe history, science, uh, it could be art, it could be nature. The, the adult, the grown-up in this case, downloads the app, um, customises it for their child, puts their child's name in, and then personalises it by taking a photograph of themselves and puts themselves in the story, and then they gift it to the, the children. So unlike most apps which uh, children might find on the App Store and then nag their parents uh, to pester them to try and buy it, which we're trying to turn this on its head. So it's actually involving the grown-ups, it could be mum, dad, uncle, aunt, uh, grandparents, godparents, actually involve them in the choice uh, about what the apps are and then turn it into a gifting experience. So in the old days you might have gifted an e-card, you might have gifted a personalised uh, picture book, but for older kids they're all on um, tablets and smartphones these days, so we wanted to make story apps that can be gifted onto the device that they love um, and brings with it a, a sharing of those passions that their parents and grandparents might already have. So this was born originally out of uh, a research piece that we did with the support of Nominet Trust, uh, looking at how technology can be used to pull families back together again. A lot of people criticise a, a smartphone technology and tablet technology for, for uh, distracting our kids. Um, and there's no doubt that kids are spending more and more time on these devices, but our view was that technology isn't inherently bad, it's what you do with it. So what we wanted to do was look at how we could use technology to help families, particularly remote families, disparate families where granddad, grandma might live the other side of the country, dad might be working away or mum might be uh, uh, working away from home a lot, um, so that they could still share in that storytelling experience in a what we call a turn-based experience. So it's not happening in real time, it doesn't require everyone to be uh, on the devices at the same time. But pull families together and share in that storytelling experience. And we've been testing it with grandparents and um, last year we did a, a beta trial um, and we got some really positive results about how it made those uh, the, the participants felt much more included in what their kids are doing and their grandkids were doing online. Parents felt there was a benefit because their uh, children and their parents were spending more time together even if it was just virtually uh, and kids reported really positive feedback about the games because for them it was opening their eyes to different topics and subjects that they might not necessarily do at school but came with this sort of added uh, value and this added sort of prestige that the grandma or grandpa was appearing in the story. So over the next few years, what we're trying to do at Gymsnap is build up a brand that is synonymous with uh, helping families stay connected through telling stories, interactive stories, particularly because it's about the devices that kids are on um, in this day and age. Initially, that's through story apps for tablets and smartphones. Uh, we think that that will move in due course, that will move possibly onto VR. Um, we're watching that um, development carefully. But there's also a big play to be had in education. We're talking to teachers and schools about how what we're doing can actually help uh, children um, move through into subjects that they're, they're going to be studying at school um, where they might not otherwise be engaged in those subjects. And also, at the same time, we're making personalised uh, television as well, with more and more television being consumed on things like Netflix and VOD platforms. There's no reason why you can't gift an interactive story to your kids to watch in between their favourite episodes of programmes. 